Good Sunday, Pepper people. This is Rhett Griffin. Welcome to Grizzly Heat. I make a video this morning. I had a lot going on, um, but I'm home now. It's the afternoon. Got another pod that I got from Tom Broom. Uh, seriously hot peppers. And I have some of his tincture right here. So let me get a drink really quick. Um, did a gusher yesterday. Some of Nick Kemp's Hell Garden tincture and one of Tom's peppers. I figured it was good to combine them. But today, I'm going to stick with Seriously Hot Peppers. This is his Reaper tincture, Seriously Hot Reaper tincture, vintage 15 month. This is aged. So he makes it with, I think, Gosling uh, whiskey or rum. Um, uh, I think it's 150. I forget what the proof is. I think that's what it is. Somebody would probably correct me on that. Um, so it's aged, so it's super smooth, but it's no flavor in this but peppers. So, and this is a chocolate habanero. Nice little pepper right here. So I figured, did one yesterday, might as well do one today. And I gotta eat these peppers. I don't want them to, uh, wanna make sure to take advantage of these things. I don't want them to get soft. Got one more I'll be eating. Might eat it later in a video or tomorrow. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna make sure I eat these. I do not want these to go to waste. There's some beautiful, super tasty peppers from Tom Broom. Thanks again, Tom. So I'm gonna just open that up. Uh, make a little pocket in there for some of this. So I'm gonna give you guys that don't know a lesson on how to do a or how to load a full Robbie. So here you go. Squeeze the bulb, let it go. Turn it over, squeeze the bulb. Turn it over, let it go. Turn it over, squeeze the bulb. Turn it over, let it go. Turn it over by that third time, you usually have the air out. And when you do that, third or fourth time you should have a full Robbie Got a little tiny bubble I'm not gonna worry about that look at the color of this stuff it's really dark and I know it's hot this is gonna be this one's brutal this is one of his hotter um, super flavorful but this is hot hot tincture um, so Let's see if I can get this full Robbie in there. So basically what you guys are doing, you hit the bulb when it's upright. And then when you turn your dropper over, you're getting the air out then turn it back upright, release the bulb. Man, this little pepper is full. Yikes. Um, but that's how you do that to get a full Robbie. Um, otherwise, you're not getting the Robbie all the way, the bulb and everything. So it's about three glass vials full when the glass and the bulb all is full. Um, not quite, but almost said three is a good number. Man, that little pepper. As you can see, ooh, there's so much things here in there. No, you can't even see it in there. Oh. But yeah, it's about three, just about three drop, three glass vial full, the glass of the bulb of the, the dropper when it's fully loaded, about three. So it's quite a bit. Sometimes I wonder why I do this, and I realize it's because I have issues. And I told Tom I would do it. So I might save that other pepper for Tincture Tuesday, because I'm supposed to do one, one of these on Tincture Tuesday. So I guess I'll have to save that uh, brain strain. Here goes this one. This is a chocolate habanero grown by Seriously Hot Peppers. 
with a full Rabi of Seriously Hot and Pepper Reaper Tincture, vintage 15 month from Tom Broom, the pepper guru, the man, amazing. You guys message him on um, Facebook Messenger, Seriously Hot Peppers. Tell him what you're looking for. Um, he'll tell you what he's got. And there you go. So, stalling long enough. Gush your time. Stay spicy. Wow. I've had this for a little while. I did. You guys shake these up before you use them. Separates a little bit. Shake them up. Give a little shaky shake. That was hot. Uh, let's see where that builds to. That is a tasty little pepper. This is some seriously hot tincture. Seeds stuck in my teeth. Ah. Yeah, mouth burn, I'm at about four or five. When I've been into it, all the tincture was in the front of my mouth, so it's in my gums. All right here. Edge of my lip, tip of my tongue. A little chocolate hob is pretty hot for a habanero. I feel it migrating back on my tongue right now. Throat-wise, I don't really have any throat burn. Maybe a little bit here, very top. A little bit of a nose run. This is hot tank, guys. Wow. That's not for the faint at heart. Probably, yeah, I'm about a four. Good mouth burn right there, guys. Oh, it's hot. I don't think it's climbing. A little bit of high water. Yeah, four or five. That was a good one. This is hot tank. Ooh. stuff good stuff yeah it's not growing anymore that's good i'll wrap this up thanks for tuning in guys i appreciate you um check out tom broom see my eyes water a little bit glassy that's hot guys my mouth burned like a it's decent it's there um you guys go check him out you want some hot stuff seriously hot peppers tom broom he's the man message him on messenger He's got a Facebook page. 
tell him what you're looking for. He'll get back to you. Might take a day or so. He's a busy man. Everyone growing peppers right now are busy. The guys, give him some grace, okay? Today was a great day. Tomorrow's going to be even better. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Love every single one of you. And as always, stay spicy, pepper people.